Hi there, I'm Daryl Williams from Fandango Productions and in this tutorial I'll be explaining how to make a menu bar on a frame. Uh, I have an ebook on my website, it's called Boa Constructor Build a Text Editor and this ebook explains how to create a, a text editor it also shows how to set up the uh, menu bar and the events uh, so we go to menu bar and it talks about adding the menu bar but in this tutorial I'll show you how to do it with bar constructor okay where we left off we created this frame just a simple frame my first application is the frame settings so now we want to put a menu bar on here the way we do that is we click on utilities data hover over here got the menu bar click that you notice it's gone white as a toggle toggle switch then you click the frame nothing appears here but you do see the menu bar here so uh, what we'll do is we'll call the menu bar main menu bar main update that update the code save it and we'll just have a look here there's the menu bar but it hasn't been set to the frame yet that's why you can't see it okay so I click the frame designer to show the frame uh, you can't see the code unless you click the update tick button save it and then you can see the scores code and when you click the frame designer the frame will appear and you can't see the source code so now we have a menu bar we'll double click that and we'll add three menus so the first one we'll call that file and click the refresh button here so that's file we we'll call this one edit refresh click the next one we we'll call that help refresh that drop it down there and we want to update the code that's been added so here we got file edit and help now we want to create the menu items so here we got menu click it in the frame there it is there click it we'll give it a name like an ID so we call that file and yeah we don't put a title in here nothing worse than getting a double getting file and then file again that's what happens if you give it a name file we've already got file here so we don't need that but we are calling this file and then we click the, the file menu file and click that we go one that'll be new open save save as and we want a separator a separator line and then add another one for exit so we go up here items zero so we'll delete the zero we go capital put the capital on we go file new and then in here you go new update it you click this one items one capital save whoops yeah file save and in here you just put and do the caps save do a refresh Up here caps on file 
save as caps of you go save as one two three refresh ah made a mistake okay so we go to this one here number three you go file open caps off open do a refresh and I'll bring this up to here by using the up arrow and then finally go file caps on file exit uh, put one E on there And here you go exit refresh and then we update the code and save it so here we have new open save save as exit and there's the separator okay so I won't do the edit or help at this stage we've created this uh, okay so now that we've done that we go new we want to give it an event we click event once and here's an event for file update down here okay take that out I did a toolbar earlier okay so here's on menu file file new that's the event okay so we'll save that event get the uh, frame up double click yep we've got an event for new we go open once menu event me, menu event or event menu double click there it is there update it save it once again open this one here we have the open one save we created that one save that save save as one click double click update and the exit one click double click update okay and I'll just click uh, create a help so up here again I click a menu click the tool uh, the frame then we get menu one we click that go to the construction details and this one we'll call help okay click in here so it's updated here and we'll give that to so this one here caps on help help so we call this help caps off help refresh and of course we'll call this one caps on help about and we go about refresh okay update that okay I'll leave you to creating the edit uh, menu with the edit menu items okay so what we do now is we got the frame we click the frame so we look in the inspector in the construction section we got the name frame we know that we click in properties and we look for menu menu bar 
go to status bar here we go menu bar and there's our menu bar main now when I click that have a look at the uh, the frame when I do that menu bar main there it is okay so first of all we'll update that and you'll notice I'll close that update save it again I'll run it now we know that we have a file menus and nothing there okay that's because now we need to link the menus with the menu bar okay so we go menu bar double click that click file and up here menu WX menu there's a drop down you select that and that is the file menus update save it okay and we'll get the frame up again double click and we have a help help menu so we click help and we look for the help menu there update it save it now we'll run it voila we have our menus that's how you create a menu bar with the menus okay so that's it for the tutorial I'm Daryl Williams from Fandangle Productions hope you enjoyed the tutorial and yes I have an ebook uh, that I'm selling online $4.95 just to cover the cost of my website and the time that's involved in producing videos and ebooks. Talk to you next time. Goodbye.